Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 8 of Nira Tamina version 1.1a. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. The ain't she? But she's not, though. Thanks. Oh, Pascal. to nothing. He does. Let's see, of course you would say that because you want to protect her. I get that.
Talk about that now. Well, nothing happened to her. I guess so. Oh. <laughs> Baby looks so fucking cute, oh my god. It is. I mean, you are wearing very nice boots. <laughs> Heeled boots, baby, so... <laughs> Yeah, so we'll just use it similar to a brooch. <laughs>
what beautiful let's say that You know, nines is the, the dumbest idea you thought of. Why, why are we going to split up? It does make you wonder, why didn't she just start with that? No. <laughs> Don't give it to her. She can't eat it. Guys. <laughs> You have to. Okay, we got to find them. This is why we shouldn't have split up.
Does something just move in the background over there, or was that just me? No. Oh. Me too. Right? Get out. No. <gasps> Don't go that way. Oh my god, nines. Just just leave. Hold up, do you see <laughs> the chain from <laughs> I love that. Oh my god. And of course whatever it is. We ain't gonna know for a hot minute. But he's not back yet. Mm -hmm. 
<clears throat> and, and that's how we ended that. Oh, okay. Okay. So now the biggest thing is who Okay, no, no, no. Then that wasn't that wasn't A2. That was Oh, 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 this ain't good. This is not good. This is, mm -hmm. Yes, one of them has longer hair, just similar to A2. And now they've met up with each other. And now there's no way neither of them can communicate with the other person. And you also tell me, so, because I think it's Adam. And Eve has to be the short-haired one. So Adam has been also secretly watching these two for the last, like, 30 minutes or so while they were both standing there having a moment and such and painted that like that. Come on now. You just secretly wanted to be eight so it's not. <laughs> like, oh my god. Oh. How the heck is 2B going to find him? I mean, yeah, you could look up the, like, last norm whereabouts of him and then start from there, but still, that tracking device and trying to connect to the network. Plus, Pod is gone! Oh my god, she about to be so screwed. <laughs> In the macro one, because I saw one today. I look good, but oh, you weren't supposed to eat it. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like the macro ending is one of my personal favorites because it's just it, it is random at first. And like, yeah, they're like, yeah, are you sure if you eat this, the oils of this macro will kill you? And I'm like, yeah, oh my god, at least. And then they're like, oh my god, I'm dying, but at least that macro was good as hell. <laughs> what? <laughs> My thing is, look at the last known location in, in tracking. But like I said, since the network is down, there is no way. Not, um, I mean, to be is able to contact, track, whatever for 9S. And now that the fact that he also, like, overlooked the commander's conversation and such, he has to hurry up and make a fake report and such. But... Who even knows because the network also is connected that they will know it's him. There's a lot of unanswered questions. And I mean, you end the episode on the cliffhanger. Yes, I also love the fact that they went from a traditional like full S screen to a wide S screen to dim the, um, especially where he was going because you're going into a narrow tight space. So they're like, okay, let's just change the, you know, the scenery of it and how it looks on the episode. Like that's really good. Just the transition of that definitely gave me feels to like Darling in the Fronts, like in a nutshell kind of. And I hope that they do more episodes like that. But the biggest issue is now, um, when episode nine is going to come out because officially, Literally, as I woke up and the, what, the second or third time today, um, found out that episode nine is now delayed as well. So this is now officially, again, the second show out of my two shows from the season that are now officially delayed and we still don't know when they're going to return. My, my little thoughts on that, I, I'm guessing maybe though it'll be about like three or four weeks or maybe five weeks and such. I'm glad that, you know, the show got to come back for a little while and we got to see a little bit more because a lot of people just still want to watch this show, including myself and stuff. And that's the same thing of how I currently feel with Misfit. Um, because Misfit is a two core series and we're still at, like, I think we're almost like at the halfway point of that show. So it feels very weird that we're 
still not continuing that and then with this we're still necessarily at the beginning and such yes i'm glad that we finally met a2 and such but we're now getting into like the bigger things that i'm like i kind of really don't remember and such but it is interesting just to see like a new version of it and seeing things that i kind of remember and then i don't but i mean yeah it just it does suck that once again due to covid that it is postponed again but i get it it's you know they had to do it for the greater good. I'm not, like, extremely pissed and everything like that. But you have to do what you have to do at the end of the day. So, I'm guessing maybe, like, a month from now. So, by the 18th of next month, the show might be back. I mean, who really knows? Um, I just hope it, it, it's not very similar, like, with Toei and with Pretty Cure and with all the other series that were airing with Toei Animation. And that was the, for, for Toei not having um the series of pretty girl or anything else airing for a very long time was kind of a little damaging to them and so i'm hoping that it isn't like that towards this show where it's like we have to wait full on maybe like two or three months before we get something but the biggest thing is it's now the waiting game because once again nobody knows when the hell we're getting episode nine it's just whenever i see on twitter or my apps that is when I will officially know. But other than that, I mean, it was a really interesting episode. Yes, You Gave My Baby is like the cutest moment ever. And it was so sweet to finally see them both without their mask and everything and their eyes. Once again, even though you get to see it in the ending. Once again, babies are just so gorgeous as fuck. Like, I just love them really too freaking much. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 8 of Nier Automata version 1.1a. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys whenever the heck episode 9 airs from now. You know, it could be a month. It could be a couple of weeks from now. Whenever. Once we do find that out, that is when officially... It'll be back. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.